It's okay. Good boy. Keep going. Keep going. You can do it, puppy. Good boy, my puppy. See, it's not that bad. You'll get used to it. That's one, that one's ready. Because this is gonna be the outside surface, so I, I don't need to sand the inside because this is not gonna be seen at all. So that is smooth and ready to go. All right, so you got two of them ready. That is gorgeously smooth. Could it be better? Yeah, but that's not bad at all. All right, so we want this 20 inches apart, so let's Make that so. All right, so I gotta cut the supports uh, at 17 inches because this is an inch, inch and a half, inch and a half, so uh, let's cut a 17 inch board. There. There we go. Alrighty, let's see, where's my measuring tape? Perfect, perfect, perfect. 20 inches all the way around. Very good. Now I just need one more support right here, then I think uh, I could just build, uh, put on the back legs. At 17 inches. That's that. 17 inches. Sorry, 17 inches on the dot. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. Hey, just remember when you do when you do projects like this around your house, it's your project. Whatever you want done is what gets done. So I feel that right here is a good way. I feel that right here is a good support in this spot. This, the Milwaukee drill bit suck. This keeps on slipping out. I was trying not to use it, but I'm gonna use Hilti. Alright, so what I gotta do next is I gotta put the legs. 
head up with the legs on the back. And I'm gonna do that starting from the top all the way down. See, it's simple stuff. This is stuff you can do on your own. You don't need a professional to build this stuff. It's easy. All right, let's uh, measure the uh, let's measure the legs. All right, so the legs are gonna need to be 20, uh, 19 and 7 eighths. 19 and 7 eighths. So leg one and leg two are done. Perfect. Perfect. I like it. I like it a lot. Now, the reason why I'm using, the reason why I'm building my own and not buying one for like sixty bucks, because uh, I my dog is like uh, ninety something pounds, and I want something that'll last and that won't break while he's trying to get on it. Do the other side. Oop, that's perfect. About right here is good. Perfect. I like it. I like that. And there we have steps. I like it. I like it. And I already got the actual steps over here. And that is what we're going to cut next. Three steps at 22 inches. So I want them to stick out an inch on each side because the width of the stairs is 20 inches. So I want it to stick out an inch on each side. So we're going to make these steps 22 inches long. Next one, 22 inches. Right there. Right on the dot. fits perfectly and then the last 22 inches right there right there time hi my puppy these stairs are for you these stairs are for you hi puppy I know I know. Oh, you you want more? Do you want more? I know my puppy, I know. I know. Alright, so as you can see, we are good. We are good to go. So what we're what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna paint this black and the legs. And next what we're gonna do is lay uh, carpet on these. I want carpet, so more like a rug. So we're gonna put a rug on these, so let's get to it.
All right, so my memory card just glitched out. Uh, obviously, uh, what I did is I put, right, so what I did is I put glue right here and then put the step on there, then I screwed, them on, I screwed them on, and now this is ready to paint. So alrighty, it's been a few hours. As you can see, it's now dark. Uh, the, I completely painted the stairs and the stairs are dry. So, and it turns out during the drying time, my wife decided she doesn't like this uh, carpet. So she wanted more blue and gray. So that's what we got. Uh, this template is, uh, it's not 100% accurate. So I actually get to make a few adjustments. It needs to be about an inch, about an inch and a half longer. So I get to do that now, but we are ready to cut, and so let's continue. And these stairs are very strong and will be more than suitable for a 90 pound dog jumping on them. Now I am not using a regular stapler. I am using a crown stapler with the 18 gauge quarter inch crown staples. And so yeah, so these things are small. As you can see, and I already did a test, they do not go through the wood, so it's all good. I got exactly what I need. Oh, that's perfect. Channel is going to start welding. So as you guys can see, it's black, and yeah, it looks good. So I'm gonna finish the other two, so uh, we'll see how it looks like after it's done. Try to, try to go up top. Try to go up top. Hey, try to, puppy, try to go up top. It's okay. Good boy. Keep going. Keep going. You can do it, puppy. Good boy, my puppy. See, it's not that bad. You'll get used to it. You'll get used to it. But as you guys can see, The stairs are complete. And not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. I know, Papa, you'll get you'll get used to the stairs. I know. I know. And as you guys can see, so you could actually build your own stairs. 